Hello everybody, I hope you're having a great day. This is just a, a quick video update just to talk about some of the issues that we've seen with the V4.11. So we released an email, you might have seen it, just saying that with the V4.11 there's some issues with Ajax and uh, just to not update we're talking with Divi about it. And we've been communicating with, with some of the Divi devs um, throughout it all. So um, we there's, there's some some of the code that we, we fixed. Well, basically, we've, we've identified that it is with Body Commerce, WooCommerce, and Divi. That's the environment that we can see it happening with machine. Even though it uses the exact same code, the same AJAX filters, it seems to be with WooCommerce that it kind of causes this issue. So uh, that's the environment. We we also tested lots in our dev and and uh, our demo websites and couldn't replicate the issues there. It seems to be a very, a very rare uh, particular uh, setup or server, server environment that we're still looking into. Um, we did release a version of Body Commerce which fixes some, some of the issues that we've seen on our side, uh, which is good. Uh, I know Divi have released an update 4.11.2 which fixes some of the issues on their side, which is good. Um, so we both, you know, getting rid of all the bugs. Um, obviously it's great to have the new features that Divi added, the conditional logic, but with new features can cause problems as, as we can see. So as of now, uh, we have the latest version of Body Commerce which works well. We, t we busy beta test in Divi Machine, which is, there's loads of features coming in there. So, but that isn't causing the issues. Uh, so what, what I would recommend, our recommendation is, to update Divi and Body Commerce if you want, um, to do it on, on Ajax filters, to do it on a staging website or a dev site first is always the best way to do things. So do it on there. And the main things to test are the Ajax filters, Ajax pagination, the load more, uh, like infinite load, anything to do with the Ajax loading of posts or, or, or products. That's what you need to be focusing your attention on. So do the updates, check it. On our sites, they, they're working fine. Like our demo cars websites, which is machine works fine. Our demo filters for body commerce works fine. Our demo filters standalone plugin works fine. So there's no problems there. Uh, if you do have an issue to roll back to 4.10.8, I think is the one that they had, that we've seen there's zero issues. And if, that, if that's the case, you can get in touch with us straight away and we can try and assist to try and figure this out. We are going to figure it out together, um, but I think it's a very rare case. Probably, you probably, a small number of you will probably have the issue. So again, do on a dev site. Even if you do on a live site, you can roll back to the previous version of Divi. That, that seems to be the, uh, the common, the common thing. If you roll back, it should be fine. But get in touch, we're always there to help, and uh, I hope this clears things up. And we're working hard as we can to get things all working and smooth and stable, and also add new features because we're adding loads. So uh, stay tuned and have a great day. Thank you.